nobody wants his last game mm -hmm. to be this one. Uh, how disappointing was that for you guys? Uh, no, it's tough. It's hard. Uh, sending all the coaches out that way, sending the, sending the class out this way, uh, it, it's tough. But, you know, we have, we have one more game left to play with each other and play together for each other. And, uh, you know, we have to come out this week of practice and we have to dominate. We, we have to be as physical as possible. You and, you and Connor carrying him off the field, I mean, was that kind of, hey, we're doing this no matter yeah, what? Yeah, no, Connor and I, we, I mean, we, we told each other when early we, we have to do this. He deserves this. He, he, he I mean, he, exp I mean, if that didn't happen, then, then that, there's something wrong. Uh, he, he's, a, he's a legendary coach. He's a, he's a legendary father, and you know th there's not enough words to describe the praise and the thanks that, that everybody on this team and that everybody everybody associated with this program has for him. A couple of the guys have said, "Hey, if you know we've seen the, the offense, it's happened before this year. Yeah. If we could fix it, we would have." Is, is there anything new to say? No, we, we just got to play. We we have to figure it out. You know, you, you see something, you see a different team from from last week to this week and you know it's it's tough to watch it's tough to play with and you know you, you just got to keep on fighting you got to keep on battling that's the number one thing we got to do is just keep on going out there and and working as hard as we can and battling as hard as we can you know and the, and the tough thing is too is like we had a really really good week of practice you know we were we were firing on all cylinders this week and you know it was tough to come out here and i think maybe the cold got to us something the emotions of the game maybe i don't know what it was but we have to come out and we got to play and, and we got to we got to dominate, and, and you know when practice comes around tomorrow, it's going to be a short week, and we're going to play a very good uh, Arkansas team with a very good defense. Uh, you know, we we, we got to we got to come out, and we just got to play football. What was, what was your reaction when you, you and Connor went to pick him up? No, I really didn't want to see his face. I didn't not really want to see his face. I didn't really see his face. Um, you know, looked like he might have been crying. I mean, he he might have been, and you know, it kind of teared me up a little bit too. And you know, it's tough to be here and it's tough to be in the situation. But you know, I'm proud of this team. I'm proud of these guys for battling and fighting as hard as they can. And you know, I wouldn't want to go through this season and, and be the captain of this this football team with with any other team out there right now. What, what about your record? <laughs> yeah, you know, it really hasn't set in yet. But uh, you know, it's something special. You know. Yeah, it's you know maybe I would like to change the outcome of the game and and you know but it, it's a special night and you know senior night and and being able to do it at home is very special. Uh, you know I, I, I want to say thank you to Coach Pingle and his staff and, and Rex and his staff and everybody that's that's helped me get to where I am right now. Uh, it, it's a blessing and, and hopefully that record's there for a long time. But but who knows? But uh, you know there's there, there could be somebody that comes comes next year and, and takes that thing away. But um, for right now, I'm going to enjoy it and, and, and just live with it and, and go. You know, we have one more game, hopefully two more games, but, but we just got to keep on battling. How surreal is it to think that Gary won't be here next year? Actually, you will. Uh, yeah. Still. You know, uh, I just finally got my rock with my parents and, uh, you know, just stood on the 50 yard line and we just looked around and saw how awesome this place was. Uh, there's a lot of awesome memories here. But how surreal is it to think that Gary won't? be coaching for Mizzou? Uh, you know, Coach Pingle's got to do what he has to do. And, you know, right now his health is health is the most important thing. You know, he can live 20 more years as healthy as possible, but he can have yeah. six more months to live. You know, it's with this kind of stuff you really don't know. And uh, he's got to do what he's got to do. It's going to be weird and not coming back or coming back and not seeing him here. But, you know, whoever whoever takes over this program is going to be the guy for the job. And I think I believe Mac Rose will do the great job. And. The guy has a lot of shoes to fill and big shoes to fill.